Good morning, church. Can we all rise to our feet? Are we ready to worship this morning? Yes. How many of you believe that praise is a weapon? Let me see your hands. Praise is a weapon. Amen. It's not just a... Uh, it's not just a time to, you know, scream and shout just for fun, but it's a powerful thing. Amen? So I'm just going to read from Exodus chapter 14, verse 10. It says, When Pharaoh drew near, the people of Israel lifted up their eyes, and behold, the Egyptians were marching after them, and they feared greatly. And the people of Israel cried out to the Lord. They said to Moses, is it because there are no graves in Egypt that you have taken us away to die in the wilderness? What have you done to us in bringing us out of Egypt? Moving down to verse 21, it says, Then Moses stretched out his hand over the sea, and the Lord drove the sea back by a strong east wind all night and made the sea dry land. And the waters were divided and the people of Israel went into the midst of the sea on dry ground, the waters being a wall to them on their right hand and on their left. So our God, he fights for us, amen? In every season, in every situation, we don't have to do anything. We know that he is our fighter, amen? If you believe that, let's sing this out together.
says we are told come let us worship and bow down let us kneel before the Lord our maker amen so let's continue to exalt him let's continue to give him the praise let's continue to worship him lift his name high above all names can we do that church
can start our day by just worshipping Him. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. Yes, Lord, you reign above it all, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you that you reign above it all, reign above all our battles, all our challenges. Thank you that you reign above all the voices in our head, all the oppression. Thank you, Lord, that you reign above it all. There is no higher name, Father God, than your name. Can we take some time to just exalt him? Just pray, just give him our prayers, our honest prayers, our honest praise, our honest worship. Just take some time to exalt him.
There is no higher name than the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 I, I want us to sing that chorus one more time. And I want us to release it and mean it. That there is no higher name than the name of Jesus. There is nothing that can stand against the name of Jesus. Every knee shall bow before the name of Jesus.
majesty worship his majesty unto jesus be your glory honor and praise sing majesty majesty king
Please take our seats. We're going to prepare our hearts to take part of the Lord's table together. Most of us would have brought these elements in. In case you didn't, please raise your hand where you are so that our ushers can come and serve you. Uh, just keep your hand lifted up in case you don't have the elements with you so that ashes can come to you and serve you then we're going to pray and partake together if you are a believer you love the Lord Jesus you're welcome to partake in the Lord's table with us this morning just please keep your hand raised in case you haven't received yet Right, let's pray. Let's pray together and partake of the Lord's table. This is an expression of our faith in Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. And what a thought that the one who was the eternal word, who is the eternal word, he became the incarnate word. He walked on the earth as the Son of God in obedience to the Father. He lived his life on the earth amidst all the sin, amidst all the wickedness. And he went to the cross for you and me, carrying our sin, carrying all the wrong we've done. He took it on himself on the cross. He broke the power of sin. He crushed the head of the serpent. He reversed the fall. What Adam put us under, Jesus, the son of the living God, came to bring us out. And he finished that. He said, it is finished. The work is done. And today you and I partake of these elements as an expression of our faith in the Son of the living God, this risen Jesus, who rose up the third day, who was ascended into heaven, who was seated at the right hand of the Father, and he's coming again as King, as Lord, and all his great power and glory. And we are celebrating him we are proclaiming him as we partake of these elements and this is an opportunity for us to receive personally by his spirit the provisions he's made for us on the cross and so i want to encourage you as you pray say lord i receive what you did for me on the cross i receive it i believe it father in jesus name we sanctify these simple elements of wafer and juice and and as we partake, Lord, we do it because we believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. We believe in what he did for us on the cross. We believe that he rose up again. He's alive today and we worship this Jesus. And Father, even as we receive these elements, we thank you for the cross. We thank you for the shed blood. We thank you for what the blood of Jesus Christ has done for us. And we thank you for the work of the Holy Spirit who administers to us the finished work of the cross, that we could live in it, we could walk in it, and be received. The Lord Jesus said, take, eat. This is my body. It's given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Let's partake of the bread together, please. The Lord Jesus said, this is my blood of the new covenant that is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. 
The blood of Jesus Christ, God's Son, has cleansed us from every sin. The blood of Jesus Christ, God's Son, has redeemed us, has delivered us. Has brought us into a new covenant with God. It covers us and we overcome the enemy by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of our testimony. Let's partake of the cup together knowing what the blood of Jesus has done for us. Let's partake together please. Father, we thank you for the cross. Thank you for the finished work. And may each of us as individuals, may our homes, our families, everything about us, Lord, glorify this risen Christ. May it reveal the greatness of the work he did. Thank you for the Holy Spirit who helps us. In Jesus' name, and everyone said, Amen. Amen. Amen.